A stone's throw from the city and the beach, Colonel Light Gardens has become hot property. We've noticed huge jumps in sales in this area. New research shows in the past 12 months it's leapt from 11th most in-demand suburb in Adelaide to first, knocking Medindi in the inner north to second place. There's no subdivisions in this area. Because of the heritage listing, you've got lovely big blocks. Nice, uh, quiet, basically place to grow a family, really. Of the top ten areas, buyers are searching for eight are south of the city. Millswood, Brighton and Seacombe Heights make the top five. Last year, Seacombe Heights was just outside the top 50. Now it's catapulted up the list to become the fourth most in-demand suburb in Adelaide. And that's good news for vendors here. The demand is starting to push prices up a little bit, but it's still incredibly affordable and a, and a really good place to, to come. It's still close to local shopping centres, Westfield Marion, Flinders University, Flinders Hospital. You've still got big land here, so whereas down on the flat down there, it's competition for all the all the space. Agents here say they're yet to see coronavirus fears having an impact on buyer confidence. And I think South Australians are, are pretty um, wise when it comes to that stuff. They don't buy into all the fear. They stock up on their toilet paper and get to the opens. <laughs> Andrea Nicholas, 7 News.